my goodness, thank you so much for joining me on this latest installation of the Map Like a Pro video series. I'm John Nelson, and in this video, I'll show you how to make perfectly crisp vector label text actually look like the rest of the map. In this map, I'm using a combination of the watercolor style and the pen and ink style. And they conspire to make a map that looks plausibly hand-drawn until you start dropping labels on this. And it looks, you know, too crisp, too perfect. How can we make this label look like it matches the rest of the map? No problem. So with that layer selected, I'll go to the labeling tab and I'll expand the text symbol options here. Now there's this really interesting drop list here called text fill symbol. And if I expand it, I can dig into the polygon symbol that's used to render this. It's just a polygon symbol. That means I can add all kinds of effects like waviness, and who knows what, right? Uh, the world is yours. You can do whatever you want. The other option was more polygon symbols. And if I click this, then it just opens up my choose a polygon symbol dialog. And I can pick any number of the existing polygon symbols that are in place for the watercolor or the pen and ink style. By way of example, I will just choose, uh, let's choose crosshatch in blue. So I'll choose crosshatch and hit OK. Now, if I hit apply, my label looks kind of hand drawn. It looks like it fits in. Isn't that neat? Okay, give it a shot. Give it a try. You can use pre-existing polygon symbols from your style or just go in and make it whatever crazy style you want. Have fun. 